Why would you support a racist? He's saying you, 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 you back to Africa. That's what he said. He said send Mexicans back to Mexico. You, you are just you, you are a disgrace to America for being a young black man Thank supporting you. a racist. Thank you. Donald Trump, what's it say? I think he's a racist. Come on, tell us why you think Trump's a racist. We want to talk about the details, man. Yeah. What about the facts? How come, how come you guys can only say he's a racist, but y'all can't talk about the facts? Why is that? His opponents uh, say that this is more proof that he's racist. And, you know, people say, is this racism? Because it sounds to me like you want to bring back the one drop rule. Yeah. No, he said that the criminals were coming over, which is a fact. Is it? I mean, some have come over, yes. So why should I be put into that category? Why should I be looked at as a bad person because I like guns? Are you, does media do that to use a white male? Of course. Oh, I'm the white man thing. Oh, you are, aren't you? Yeah. Got good eyes. Does anyone on the left actually care about racism? Or is it just being used as a Solinsky-esque tool to polarize the sheep into bleeding what they have been told is true? Because according to Dolly Kyle, the former high school girlfriend of Bill Clinton, Bill and Hillary Clinton regularly used racial epithets and looked down on poor people. Kyle makes the accusation in her book, Hillary, The Other Woman. In addition to calling mentally disabled children at a governor's mansion Easter egg hunt effing retards, Kyle says Hillary referred to the people of Arkansas as ignorant hillbillies. Hillary also allegedly used derogatory terms for Jews, including effing Jew bastard. Bill, Kyle insists, called the Reverend Jesse Jackson a GD N-word. Latinos were similarly slandered and profiled. Kyle continues, For no good reason, Bill and Hillary decided to profile Hispanics as drug dealers. Specifically, Arkansas troopers were to stop and search cars driven by Hispanics, especially those cars with Texas license plates. Clinton's criminal apprehension program was ruled unconstitutional. Kyle continues, Billy threw one of his infamous temper tantrums about the ban on his racial profiling of Hispanics, and he threatened to renew the racial profiling program in spite of the court's ruling. The Daily Beast notes, Clinton's Violent Crime Control and Law Enforcement Act of 1994, authored by then-Senator Joe Biden, was supported by virtually every Democrat in Congress, including then-Representative Bernie Sanders. That legislation led to the mass incarceration of black Americans. Legal scholar Michelle Alexander notes, Bill Clinton presided over the largest increase in federal and state prison inmates of any president in American history. Alexander accused the Clintons of decimating black America and said Hillary does not deserve the black vote. In response to pressure by Black Lives Matter, Hillary apologized for her role in pushing for the bill. Despite Hillary's alleged racism, a large number of blacks, especially in the South, turned out to vote for Clinton during the primaries. The Huffington Post notes, both Clinton and her husband, former President Bill Clinton, have traditionally had solid support from blacks, a key component of the Democratic electorate. In May, a Fox News poll revealed 62% of Latino voters favored Clinton over rival Donald Trump. Evelyn Perez Badia, analyst with Political Passion, told Fox News Latino there's a more hospitable tone that Hillary Clinton is taking in terms of communicating with Hispanics. Compared to Donald Trump, it's a much different message, simply because it's a fabrication. Snap out of it, fake liberals. The giant boulder of truth just crushed those little plastic lies painstakingly set up to misinform in the name of George Soros and his New World Order stooges. There's a real good reason why Hillary Clinton respected former Senator Robert Byrd, Byrd, also known as an exalted cyclops of the Ku Klux Klan. John Bound for Infowars.com. The knowledge of the ancients, tried and true, trusted herbs and extracts fused with the latest nutraceutical science. Introducing the all-new Ancient Defense Herbal Immunity Blend, crafted with over 14 key ancient herbs and extracts to supercharge and prepare your body for what experts admit is the most dangerous season of the year. 
we have rejected hundreds of other formulations in our quest to bring you what is simply the most powerful and comprehensive proprietary formula that we have ever created in the realm of herbal immunity. For the last two years, our team has been working with top doctors, nutritionists, and chemists to develop the ultimate nutraceutical formulation. Experience the benefits of combining over 14 ancient herbs and extracts with exciting new advances in nutraceutical science. Now is the time to secure Ancient Defense for you and your family. Visit ancientdefense.com or call 888-253-3139. That's ancientdefense.com. 